little test on how long it takes to load Ubuntu on a virtual machine on a Windows in Windows. This is on a Asus EPC 1000H, the 160 gigabyte hard drive. This is going to be my first attempt at uh, running Ubuntu off of a 16 gigabyte SD card. And I'll be running it in a virtual machine, that way I can toggle between Ubuntu and Windows just by uh, hitting Control and Alt. Hopefully. That way I get to play around with all the neat Linux stuff and still keep my Windows application for school. I apologize for the funny audio. I have a really bad head cold. And I'm hoping this works, because if I can uh, run Ubuntu off of a SD card, then I don't have to bother installing it on the hard drive. And freeze up space for other stuff for the time being at least and I think after I get out of school I'll probably just switch to Ubuntu altogether or maybe one of the other Linux flavors. Maybe I'll take some time and try them all. I'm thinking this is gonna, probably going to have to be a little faster than this for it to be practical though. Almost there, come on, you can do it. Well, the flash card I got was a uh, Class 6 Kingston SD card, SDHC card. Oh, looks like everything's loading okay. Not sure why we have two cursors there. Ah, oh, here we go. As you can see, the cursor will only stay in the box with Linux, with the uh, Ubuntu operating system. I believe to switch to Windows, we just hit Control Alt, and let's see, cursor turn black, and ah, uh, yep, yeah, now we can go back to Windows. Close that out. We can go to my computer.
all that good stuff. And then if we want to go back to the Linux, Control Alt. And once again, we're in Linux box, or OS. Accessories, games, graphics, internet. Let's see if we can get on a Firefox. There we go. I don't see if we're actually, actually online. Well, that's about to work out another day. Well, at least I know I can do it. <laughs>